welcome to the Watchman on the Wall channel. This prophetic word excerpt comes from Krista Elisha, Oxford, Ohio. A mega outpouring. As we lay down all we have for God's glory, we will see another mega outpouring of God's spirit come to those that are hungry, humble, and willing in this hour. He will give them influence over the nations as witnesses of Jesus Christ and his fullness. God has not used the warfare to punish you, but to empty you. We cannot be full of God if we are full of ourselves. The anointing comes with crushing to get us out of the way, so more of him can get in. There is an invitation for us to go before the Lord and surrender all of our plans to God. Our flesh, our desire, plans and our ministries, our schedules, our agendas, and even our ambitions. We exchange it for the weighty presence of the Holy Spirit so that it comes in greater measure. If you've been experiencing pressures of life, allow this to push you into the fresh death to self with prayer and fasting. In this place of humble submission to the Holy Spirit, you will cultivate fresh oil. God can send you his fire. He is searching for combustible people, willing to be lit up, sent out, sent out into the darkness with power from on high to prove that Jesus Christ is who he says he is. The Savior of the world, this fire, it isn't for you to feel warm and fuzzy. It's to draw the broken, the lost, the hurting into the eternal flame of God's burning heart of love for them. We must be willing and ready to invest and to sow into others the gifts that are deposited into us. Hallelujah. Let's pray into this word together, friend. Lord Jesus, we do. We ask you. We ask you to pour out on our lives. Pour out in our churches and our communities, Father. Lord Jesus, cultivate in us burning hearts. Hearts not in it for the warm and fuzzy or, or to get our ears tickled by, by prophecy or gifts. But Lord Jesus, that you would cultivate fresh oil. Lord Jesus, make me a combustible person. I love that. Make my friend combustible. That the oil of your presence, the oil of your anointing would flow over us, Father. And that our, our lives would be set ablaze for you. Lord Jesus, we do come hungry. We do come humble. We are willing, Father. Help us to submit to you, to submit our plans and our purposes to you, Father. Thank you for allowing this great exchange. Our flesh and desires and what we think we've built up for what you have. Friend, it's greater. What God has in store for your life is greater than what you have in store. I'll, I'll grab onto that word. Lord, we love you and we thank you for this mega outpouring in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.